been exciting to see how this high-profile event centered on race relations has accelerated the conversation. The Reds will be part of making sure this dialogue continues through the Civil Rights Day weekend 2010 and beyond. It's fitting that the kickoff for the important weekend happens here at the Freedom Center, as it is a place dedicated to revealing freedom stories from the era of Underground Railroad to contemporary times, challenging and inspiring everyone to take courageous steps for freedom today. I think we're definitely headed in the right direction, but there's a lot of work to do. Everybody's happy for it for the best. I don't know how it comes out for the best. You know, you might have some difficult times sometimes, and you may not agree with everything, but you know, you got people fighting it. And if, if things work for you, and you got the right guy, then you know you can Yeah, I think so. I think it's much needed. Something that people were afraid to speak out on a few years ago. But now, since we live in a society where it's got to be a unified society, these things cannot be it. Everybody should know the plight of everyone else. And I would believe this is going to make a better future, not only for myself, but for my kids. talk about what it's going to be like this year, not just comparing it to Memphis. So um, we've been thrilled with the, uh, the, the recognition that it's gotten. And again, we think uh, even better things for next year once Cincinnati and greater Cincinnatians, Northern Kentucky, Indiana, and Ohio, everybody understands what it is. Hopefully we have that much more inclusion and uh, involvement next year.